Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the Mad Skills Motocross YouTube channel. I am your host, Transcend. Today we're going to be going over another basic tutorial, and I'm going to be showing you how to upgrade the parts on your bikes. Now, as you can see in the top right hand corner of your screen, I do have 780 silver coins and 48 gold coins. Now, if you click the button on the top middle with the two bikes on it, it'll take you to this menu. Now you can choose which bike you want to upgrade. Uh, and I only have bike one. So if you click this uh, button right here with the wrench and the screwdriver, takes you to the upgrade menu. Now you can decide which part here on the right you want to upgrade. And so we'll start from the top here. And if you want to upgrade your plastic, just hit the upgrade button here. Now you can see here above the 40 coins, it says that it does deliver in 10 seconds. But as you get to some of the epic and legendary parts, you will see that that time is a lot longer. So if you want to have it deliver instantly, you can use your gold coins and it will automatically install on your bike. So for the sake of showing you for this part, we will do the 40 coins. And as you can see, it's counting down as it delivers and gets that part ready to go. And once that part does deliver, you can see there you hit fit part and it is installed. And there you have it. Now, as we go down to the epic parts, as I said, you can see here the delivery time on it is two hours. So if you don't want to wait that, you can hit instant delivery with the four gold coins and boom, it is instantly installed on your bike. Now. Another separate way to get to this menu is if you are in the race and your game knows that uh, if you have some extra money and you want to upgrade your bike, you can also access it from this menu. Every time you do a new race, it'll give you the option to upgrade your bike. And once you get your bike fully upgraded, then this green button on the bottom will actually go away. We'll go ahead and hit that. You can see here it takes us back to the same menu where we can go ahead and upgrade our bike again. Now the next mentionable thing about bike upgrades is as you upgrade each part and you get it to a specific level, like if I have all of the parts here and I get every single one of these parts up to rare, there you go, see I got that achievement there on the top right. All of my parts on this bike are now rare. I gotta go through one by one and fit the part, that way you install it. You can see there my total power has gone up quite a bit. And as you go down or you go back to the bike menu, you can see here now above bike one, it says rare. So that is how you know how far upgraded you have your bike. Obviously the goal is to get all of the parts to legendary, which is the very bottom. And once you do that, then that top part right there above bike one where it says rare will say legendary and you will know that you have your bike fully upgraded. Uh, the max power there, it tells you how fast that bike is going to be. So once you get it fully legendary, the power on that bike is going to be 1,013. And also worth mentioning is that even with this bike fully upgraded, it will not be as fast as the base model bike two. So each bike you go up, it will start out faster than the previous bike. All right, guys, that is how to upgrade your parts on the bike in order to make it faster here in Mad Skills Motocross 3. I hope this video helped you guys and I hope you got something out of it. If you're a fan of Mad Skills and you want to see some more tutorials and videos like this, feel free to leave a like on the video and make sure you subscribe and turn those notifications on that way you know whenever we post the next video. Thank you guys so much for your support and we'll see you in the next one.